Hello, Type Choice here. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to create a footer in Adobe InDesign. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So as you can see, I have just created a new InDesign document. And if we go into our page panel right here, we can see that we only have one page. If you cannot see the pages panel, you can also find it up in window and go down to pages. The keyboard shortcut for that is F12. And let's say that we actually want to add a footer to our pages. We can actually do that in a few easy steps. So the first thing you want to decide when creating a footer is that if we want it on all of our pages in our document, we want to create it on a parent page. So let's just say I had 30 pages and we want this footer to be on all of them. We want to create them up right here. So first of all, let's just create some new pages. I just go down right here and add some more pages, just like this. So now we have five pages and let's say we want to add a footer for all of them. Go up to your parent right here, onto your page and just Double click on this, just like this. Now let's just create some text for our footer. So go over to the toolbar in the left side of the screen and choose the type tool. The keyboard shortcut for that is T. Just select that and create a text box right here. And we can just write some text, just like this and scale it up so we can see it a bit better. Something like this. And then we can actually just move this down right here. So it's a footer. And then that is actually it. If we now try to go back to our first page right here, we can see that the text is now applied. And the same thing is for all of our other pages. So if we select the second page, we can see that it is still there. And it is selected on all of our pages. And that's because we created this on the parent page. And as you can see, if I tr now try to actually select it, it is locked. And if you want to unlock this, you want to go up to the parent page again, double click on it. And from here, you can delete it or change it. And if I just change the footer, let's just give this a color. Just like this. And if we go back to our pages, we can see that it has been changed for all of our pages. So yeah, that is actually how to create a footer in Adobe InDesign. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. That was all for now. See you in the next one.